Hello, everyone. Thank you for stopping by. I am your host, Rob, Legion Cage, whatever you want to call me. <clears throat> I do appreciate you stopping by for my Let's Play of Final Fantasy. If you do like what you see, please make sure to give me a follow. I am 17 follows away from my first goal, which is 50, and I'm giving myself to the end of the month to do that. And then some time after that if I need to, you know, it's kind of a floating goal. So, you know, hey, that's what it is. But yeah, so, Skeledud, I see you there, sir. Uh, how convenient that you're there, because I was going to... You can call me awesome, absolutely, Ingle Doom. I, I appreciate you stopping by. But yeah, if you guys, uh, well, I know Skeledud obviously follows Skeledud. I'm pretty sure Ingle Doom does too already. But if you don't know, Skeledud is a cool streamer. He's obsessed with Transformers. Uh, we have been playing Wargroove together, uh, usually on Thursdays. Um, but, <laughs> but yeah, if you haven't already given him a follow on Twitch or his various other social medias, you can give him a follow there. Also, a uh, friend of both me and Skeledud, Watch Whitney, uh, formerly known as Dragon Lily 21 She has rebranded herself again back to Watch Whitney because she is Whitney and we are watching her play things. So mostly horror games because that's what she does, that's what she loves, and she loves dying as well. So if you haven't already, please make sure to give Watch Whitney a follow on twitch.tv slash watchwhitney. You can also follow her on her various socials as well. And since Ingle Doom is here, I'll throw it out there again. I apologize for my very crudely made shout out card, but I had one. I had one ready for the last time that I did Final Fantasy, uh, and here it is again. Uh, uh, if you guys get a chance and you like uh, retro stuff or card games or like all kinds of things, CR Game Room is definitely a great place to follow. Um, they do all kinds of different things. Uh, I was watching a couple of the guys play uh, Fall Guys last night, uh, which is a very very entertaining game. So very very good stuff there. No, it does not mean tiny little clocks on the wrist, Skeleton. <laughs> but yeah, we are going to get back into uh, our... I clicked the wrong button, because, you know, that's what I do, is click the wrong buttons. Boom. There we go. All right. Yes, holy shirt indeed. <laughs> Murdered. <laughs> Uh, you are very welcome, Ingle Doom. Uh, I appreciate the fact that uh, not only did uh, you guys give us some shout-outs on your stuff um, and, and your hosting and all that kind of thing, uh, so, ha you know, got to return the favor. Greatly appreciate it. Greatly, greatly, greatly. Um, let me get my sound back up on the game here because I turned it down because it tends to want to just do its own thing while I'm trying to do my intro. Boop, 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 boop. And yes, Skeledud, I am in space. Because what better way to do a game than go to space? Okay, let's get in on this. I have no clue what's going on other than we're in space. We've got the third gem lit. We're going to get the fourth gem lit. Everything is going to be lit. Uh, you are perfectly fine, Ingle Duo. I greatly appreciate you no matter what. Ah, we're okay. Where are we going? Let's see here. Honestly... The... Items in here seem like poop. So, we're going to move on. We're going straight to level 2. I'm not messing around with this. I'm finishing this stuff. Oh, look at this guy. Look at this guy. This guy doesn't know what he's in for. This guy's going to get smacked. Smacked. 
Now there is, on floor two, a couple things that I need. Really, Skella? That eye is hot, huh? <laughs> good to know, good to know. Alright. So this is the floor. The adamant is here. That's how I make the... Um, the Excalibur. I also need number six, which is supposed to be over here. Let's see if the guide is accurate or if it's a bunch of trash. Ugh. Those stupid unicorns. I don't like those things. That they will, Ingle Doom. That they will. Evil man gonna die. I can't hold anymore. Why can't I hold anymore? It's because I got too much crap, that's why. Oh, I don't need that ribbon. Ha! Huh, never mind. What's in this other treasure chest? I might as well grab it while I'm here. Opal shield? Is the Opal shield better than the Aegeus shield? I don't think it is. So, nope. We're going away. Bye! Leaving all the crap. You should... Hmm... I don't know if you should necessarily wait all the way till September. But September's not that far. I would say what you should do is wait until you get your camera. And then you can unbox them together. Maybe? Monster Strike Face. <laughs> Look at me and the monsters. Blah, 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 blah. Defenseless? That's not cool. Jesus. Well, this is a problem. Ouchie. <sighs> well, sadly, you can't let that happen. Shh. 
our secret. It's my secret and I'm sticking to it. Hey look, it's Skella Dud's eye again. Right? Evil man, this little thing freaking does a level 8 nuke spell and trashes the entire party. It's okay, I know exactly where I'm going, so. Ho ho, ho ho ho. Welcome back, loser. Try this again. <laughs> I can deal with lots of damage, but just straight annihilating me in one hit. That's just not cool. Uh, excuse me for one second, everyone. I do greatly apologize that I have to step away for a second. Ugh. That looks bad. Looks real bad. I'm about to fix that. But I'll be right back. Skella, you are the captain of nothing. Sorry to break it to you there, Chief. False alarm. Thought I had an issue I had to take care of, but I didn't. Adamant. Yeah. I can get the Excalibur. Because the Excalibur is the good stuff. Oddly enough, it's the second best sword in the game. It's not even the best sword in the game. What are these goobers? Like... We're going to light them all up. I didn't do as well as I had hoped. Mr. Thief's not doing so hot with the, uh... Yeah, the Masamune is the strongest, strongest sword in this version of Final Fantasy.
yes, uh, the Masamune has appeared in most versions of Final Fantasy. I don't think that's one of my fun facts, but maybe it should have been. I don't know. Maybe I'm missing on that. Well, they're definitely not able to be hit with the uh, physical. Okay, these things just suck. Well, if at first you don't succeed, run away like a coward. record skipping I mean I thought so and I used ice and it did more damage than lightning but it I mean I also used ice 3 versus lightning 2 and the difference wasn't exponential unfortunately Oh, I can't wait till I get to the next game and be able to, like, have good man like management systems. Alright. There is a thing that I need on this level. It is the katana. And it's in the direction that we're going, so we're going to waltz over here. From this window, one can see the entire world. The four forces are flowing together into the center of the four altars, into the Temple of Deeds. There's a little foreshadowing. Oh, Shiza. Hello, friends. How are you this fine day? Let's see how many of them it takes to... Oh! Well, I just wasted three turns. Awesome! Go me! Apparently these dudes are weak. What about Power Man for him? Well, 
Well, if I remember correctly, I believe you actually did vote for Final Fantasy IV already. Um, but on my Twitter account, I am taking votes for uh, like an official poll as far as which one I'm playing. And technically, my posts on Facebook, people can comment and we can go from there as well. But, um, I mean, honestly, you know, Final Fantasy IV is, I, I believe I did say it, my favorite of the linear series. Um, and I've always found six to be overrated. Um, but I do need to play through both of them, I think. So, Medusa's. Let's see if I can get rid of the man cats and then we'll worry about the medusas. rude. Stupid buttheads. Bye bye, man cat. Man cats terminated. This is what you call a rinse and a repeat. Poom. Is the game sound coming through pretty good for everyone? My voice not too loud. Katana. That's right. Awesome. Thank you. some more HP here, considering that seems to be all he's doing is taking damage. Okay. Anything else of use in those chests? gold. We'll take gold. We like gold, right? Gil? I like gold. I'm coming for you, Tiamat. Whoa. Now y'all just being rude. But as the, uh, nah, no, no. Let me say, as the kids say, let's say, let's, uh, yellow this, but Nah, there's too many of them. When I get into a fight where I'm facing too many monsters, 
it doesn't really seem to matter how powerful you are, it just seems to muff you pretty bad. Onward to the boss man. Oh boy. Do, 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 do. My thing is on there. Century. I think I read something about this. No, it's the War Mech. It's the War Mech. The War Mech's the evil butthead. <laughs> so, on the next level. There is there is a creature that has as much HP as the fourth fiend, and he's kind of like he's not like a hidden not like a hidden boss, but he's like that rare enemy that you proverbially don't want to run into. I kind of want to run into it. Do y'all think we can take him? literally fighting the air. Oh, Angle Doom says I can take him. Do we go hunting for him? <laughs> that that is the major question then. I see there are plenty of people just kind of lurking in chat. Do we go after the war mech or no? Oh, Dingle Doom says we hunt him down. I like the way you think. Skella says bloodlust. We hunt down the war mech tonight, boys. Full disclosure, I may be enjoying my favorite beverage during this stream this evening. So, just FYI. How big is this stupid place? Ah, oh, it's a maze. Cheap buttheads. <laughs> Monster strike first. Blah, blah, blah. Wait, you can't be a. You can't be called fighter. I have the fighter. Skeledug. You better be back for the hunt. left until you reach an intersection, and then up until you reach a transporter. The Nacho! 
We'll send Skeleton some nachos for dinner. Right? Some nachos do sound delicious. Ooh, fighter level up. Every time with the stupid rearranging of my characters. Take a hard raid check on this one, ladies. I think everyone will appreciate how the flow works in the next games as well, so I mean, a little bit more graphic-y, a little bit less BS with the waiting for the menus to click, I'm clicking as fast as I can, and it still doesn't do nothing. Okay, so it said go left one intersection and then walk up until you get a transporter. So, where's the stupid transporter? who are hurting, and I got people who are were stunned. Time to cure up a little bit. Running out of heal potions. Have to give you guys a couple fun facts while I restock. <laughs> Once we're out of here. you do I'm, I really am <clears throat> uh, they will be uh, once I reach my affiliate level I believe they will be something you can actually purchase with the little bubbly things that way you, you guys can choose when you want them versus just waiting for me to do them so I think this is full of crap.
Okay, so this thing says left two times, up two times. <laughs> I don't know if I believe it. I just thought I was just gonna waltz right in. Hey, Mr. T, man, I'm here to smack you upside your stupid head. And his stupid maze. Had to be the stupid maze. <sighs> Red maids level up. two times. <sighs> no. That's a big old bag of no. Hello. Your boy mage is getting plomped on, like usual. the one whomping on your black mage. It's these stupid rude enemies that cast level 8 magic. That should not be able to cast level 8 magic. Maybe I would have leveled him better if he would have stayed alive long enough to be leveled. What now? <laughs> Nacho's back. In fairness, he's been a lot better since he uh, became a wizard and got a fancy knife, so... Okay, well, this thing's full of crap. I'm lost in a stupid maze. I'm almost out of drink. Two sections east and two sections south. Okay. Two sections east and two. Which way is east? That way. Right? Uh, we're going to... As soon as I can figure out my way out of this place, we're going to hunt the Warmech. We might hunt the Warmech. We'll see. I'm almost out of healing potions, so... 
I might just have to go to uh, Tiamat and finish it out. Exactly what I say every day at work. I use out the rest of my potions. Even then, I'm not going to be able to heal them all the way. I think all of these things that I looked up online are full of it. <clears throat> I might actually have to just watch this stupid video here. BRB, sorry. I'm gonna cheat a little bit. Well, this is garbage. Alright, 
So it's two sections east and two sections south. That's what I did. I mean, I thought I was sure. East would be to the right, right? Well, that's good, at least. Uh, Ingle do them. Uh, that way you don't get banned for anything bad. You shush, Whitney. I don't need none of your sass. Okay, there's one section. Run away! Okay, now I'm gonna go one extra section, just to be sure. Uh, really? I don't have the supplies to fight all you idiots. Oh, oh, did we find it? We found it! Huzzah! We'll blame Skeledud since he's not here. Yes, huzzah indeed. <laughs> but we're about to come up against the boss, so you know what that means. Yes, always blame Skella. Uh, so, fun fact. Um, let's see, which one did I do last? Okay, I'll do, I'll do, uh, I'll do two of them, because technically one of them is kind of already discussed, um, because we, I was talking about which one I'm going to play next. Um, but first off, most people already know this, but the games we know in America for the Super Nintendo as Final Fantasy 2 and 3 are actually... Final Fantasy 4 and 6, respectively. The original Final Fantasy 2 and 3 were released in Japan for the NES system and never released to the United States until much later for newer consoles. Um, part of this was because while Final Fantasy sold well in Japan and decently in the United States, people weren't still down with this whole RPG thing. And Final Fantasy 2 was a departure from the game that you're seeing me play, Final Fantasy II used a skill-based leveling system similar to something you'll see in uh, games like Elder Scrolls Skyrim, as opposed to traditional XP and levels. So there is your fun fact for the boss, or the battle with Tiamat. Or before the battle with Tiamat. Now, I'm going to level, or, uh, use my last heal potions here because A, this is the final of the four fiends and he is not to be trifled with, I assume, but I also kind of want to run into that war mech. Alright, this is it. This is all I've got on him. Save real quick. Let's cross this bridge. Where are you, Warmack? <laughs> Won't even bat an eyelash to these two. Or four. Two, four, whatever they are. They're something.
He is scared. As he should be. You know, the sad part is, I think that if, uh, if I actually came across Wormick and fought him, I'd probably have to uh, go back and leave and buy potions and stuff just to be able to uh, go after Tiamat. <laughs> Wormick or nothing, folks. And it will be nothing. What up, loser? Lightning erupts from the fiend's ball, so you have come this far. I, Tiamat, the fiend of the wind, will now put an end to your adventure. Oh, will you now? I don't think you will. I think I'm going to smack you around a little bit. Oh, 13 hole damage. That's a good sign. Hmm. May have a bigger problem with TMF than I uh, originally anticipated. Ouch. Let's hit him with the big one. Alright, now you cut that out. Ouch. There goes Red Mage. And my quick way out of here. Nutic did some de decent damage. There we go, there's a nice hit. <clears throat> That's not cool. Please don't poison. Oof. Skella's ninja's about to go down. Give it a minute. Mage will join him soon. Oh, that was a good hit. And he's down! I win! Huzzah! Unfortunately, he killed my red mage. 
so that hurts. Unless, unless this, we're going to be able to just power up the orb and wander on out of here, which would be nice. Sweet! I don't remember where I parked. Just when you thought Black Mage was safe. I find a bunch of goobers in the desert. Ninja. Poor Skella is even here to see his guy go down. down to fighter and black mage crazy stuff maybe I'll just let black mage die for funsies Airship! I remembered where I parked. So, with that, I have successfully lit all four orbs. Which means now I have to figure out what to do with them. But first, I feel like my party needs revived. Because that's a marsh cave. So that means Corneria should be right up here. Huzzah! Never pay expensive people to do a cheap man's job. Go back to Corneria, and I can raise him for half the price. Tenth of the price. And stay at the end for a fraction of the price because that's the best thing in the world. All right, so uh, we'll bring in Thief here again. Get us another fun fact going here in a second because uh, I need to spend some time. Uh, purchasing um, uh, heal potions so this will take a few minutes while we just kind of discuss so I'll give you guys another fun fact and I already forgot it because you know go me Ooh. okay <clears throat> so um, Despite more commonly associated with black magic or blood abilities, the original appearance of the Dark Knight, which was in Final Fantasy III for the NES, could use white magic. Most commonly, uh, Dark Knights have used some form of black magic, uh, like I said, or some kind of ability where they, they sap their own HP to be able to... Uh, power their abilities. 
So it was kind of interesting to hear that in the original version of Final Fantasy III, um, they did they used white magic. But I think uh, they, I think they did correct that in the uh, 3DS or DS re-release um, when it came over to the states for the first time officially. So yeah. Well, and simply because uh, I am nowhere near done buying heal potions, um, I'll give you all another fun fact here as well. As you can still hear me buying in the background, I'm sure I should probably turn that down. Oh well. Um, so, Final Fantasy IV, as I've mentioned, is actually probably my favorite of the linear series. Um, the original game was so large that the, re that the writer revealed years later that he had to cut roughly 75% of the storyline due to system limitations. The game was actually supposed to be almost four times as long uh, as it ended up being. So, um, and going off of that, because of how much was cut from the original game, it resulted in the game getting a sequel titled The After Years um, many, many, many years later. Uh, for the PSP. So yeah, a couple more fun facts there for you. Everyone doing all right out there? Enjoying our Monday evening? Angle doing, what are you guys playing on the uh, arcade tonight? Whitney, you're still typing up notes? Gosh. Murdered. Basketball playoffs and uh, Forza. Okay, all right. Forza is good. You playing Horizon 4? Give a break and prep for your PTO. Sounds like slacking, but okay. And Cuphead from the arcade. Okay. All right. You guys are real gluttons for punishment on that Cuphead, aren't you? Okay, you should, uh, if you don't have have one, uh, you could get a death counter, like, uh, like Watch Whitney has. Check your deaths. Okay, I think I, I think I got enough. Holy guacamole, that's a lot of deaths. Oh yeah. Okay. First order of business. Get out of my way, dude. Come on! <laughs> At least you admit it.
my apologies for my cursor randomly being on the screen. Ah, really? Drop this stupid thing. I am greedy. Now give me my sword. Yes. I have X caliber. Okay, so this is pretty much it. We have the final temple. And here's the kicker. The final temple is actually the first temple that you step foot inside in the game. Bum 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 all will be explained as soon as I figure out which town I need to go back to. Because I don't remember which town it is. Because, you know, reasons. Okay, each sage is in Crescent Lake. I remember how to get to Crescent Lake. We're good. Yes, I know we're like right, like mind blown. We'll do them. Uh, Tara is playing Final Fantasy IX. That is pretty awesome. Final Fantasy IX is one of the few ones that uh, I don't think I've ever actually completed. I do really like 10. Ten is probably my fourth favorite, I would say. I'd say it goes two, eight, seven, and then probably ten. As far as the linear ones go. <laughs> I did love me some Blitzball. Old dudes! Old dudes! I got the four orbs. What do I do now? I know what I do now, but they're supposed to tell me what I do now. Well, you're no help. Y'all are telling me the same stupid stuff. What did that guy say? We must use force only for just purposes.
Time will repeat itself every 2,000 years, breaking time loop. I see now someone who traveled back 2,000 years is the cause of the world's destruction. After 2,000 years, he will travel back again, then again, then again. Someone traveled 2,000 years to the past. The four fiends were sent forward in time. Those fiends threatened to destroy the world today. Time is repeating. In order to break the time loop, you must eliminate the enemy who controls from 2,000 years in the past. With the four orbs shining again, break the time gate can be broken. The true enemy is 2,000 years in the past. The Temple of the Fiends is the center of the four altars. The time has come to destroy the source of evil. Bum, 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 bum. Is there really a statute of limitations like when it comes to a game like this old? Would I be spoiling anything if I told you guys the big twist? We're as good as we're going to get. The four orbs now cover the black orb. To take step forward is to go back 2,000 years in time. Ba -na -na -na. Let's see here. is use the exit spell. Well, the spoiler is that the very first enemy you faced... Or the very first boss you faced, Garland, is actually the very final boss. Chaos. Bum bum bum. Game's thirty plus years old. If you if you had a problem with spoilers, I'm sorry. Dang, Excalibur dropping the hammer. Mage leveling up. Let's see what we can do against these schools. So it appeared that I'm going to have to go up and then fight my way back down, perhaps. I know that I have to fight all four fiends. And they're a little bit stronger than they were in their original forms. I'm 
looking at my time here. Got about a half an hour left. Bad mans. There's a lot of bad mans. I really need to save my actual spells as much as possible. What do you got that's usable? Sure, why not? Sunday, Sunday, Sunday! I can't remember what the hell the name town uh the name of the town is that we're in. Helm's Hold. Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. Come on down to Helm's Hold, where we're gonna smack Rohini upside her stupid face. Or she'll smack you upside your stupid face. Whichever. We don't know yet. Stupid face indeed. I don't think y'all are ready to face her. You have spider powers, huh? I don't think your spider powers are going to save you. Spider powers, spider powers. Murdered has the spider powers. Spins a web any size. Doesn't realize he's still gonna die. Oh yeah. Yeah, him and his spider powers. I wish I had spider powers too. Crawl up walls. Make work a little bit more interesting, I think. Come down hanging off of the ceiling.
Wait, which part is creepy? Having spider powers and being able to like hang down from the ceiling in the store? <laughs> I think that'd be fun. You're just jealous because you don't have a store big enough that you can swing around with your web powers in. I mean, I'd settle for just being able to fly around my store. It's too big to walk around. That it would be. It would be awesome. Like, try to get around e either by flying or web sling. Okay. Well, unfortunately, my people, my peoples is dying. I'm gonna cruise back out here. We're gonna camp out. We're gonna save, and I think we'll call it tonight. Um, simply because of the fact that uh, we're in the final dungeon. Now, good news is, however, that we are going to, um, despite the fact that I'm going to call this tonight, I don't know why I'm messing with that, now I can just do it on here. Um, I'm actually off the next couple days, uh, short of an inventory, and I have already... I have already stated that I am finishing this game this week. I'm going to finish my Let's Play of Final Fantasy this week officially and put put to bed something that I've wanted to do for 27 years, which is completely play through this game again. Um, so, looking at tomorrow, uh, probably early afternoon... I think we're going to resume this, and I'm going to attempt to do the Temple of Fiends. We're going to finish this bad boy out. Uh, thank you, everyone, for coming and hanging out. I really do appreciate it. A couple things here real quick. Go in reverse order this time from how I did earlier. Uh, so shout out to uh, Ingle Duel and CR Game Room. Uh, thank you for coming and hanging out with me tonight. I appreciate you. Uh, definitely if you guys get a chance if you haven't already followed CR Game Room uh, they do all kinds of things ranging from uh, like just chatting sessions with uh, they, did, they did a bit of, um, that Marvel dice game uh, they did a bunch of unboxings for those that was really cool they, they were playing Fall Guys last night they're playing Cuphead tonight the good scene so yes if you get a chance if you're uh, checking me out go check them out as well also hanging out with us tonight was uh, Watch Whitney, a very good friend as well. You can find her on twitch.tv slash Watch Whitney, uh, Twitter and Instagram as well. Uh, playing horror stuff. I'm assuming she's going to be streaming, I think you just started, uh, Alan Wake. So, 
Alan Wake continuing here soon, I'm sure. And even though he peaced out to go eat dinner, you can always check out my buddy Skeletod. Uh, we've been streaming Wargroove, um, and he does random other streams. Besides just being obsessed with Transformers, you can find him at twitch.tv slash Skeletod. Appreciate you guys all coming and hanging out with me. I really do do appreciate it a lot. That's the wrong one. That's what the heck? How did that? I messed up my stuff. Hold on, I gotta change this. I broke it. Okay. Four. Four. And apparently, oh, I know why. Never. I, yeah, I gotta mess. I gotta fix all that. I don't want to hear it from you, Miss. I mess up all my stuff all the time. Anyways, uh, yeah, thank, <laughs> thank you all again for watching. Uh, special shout out to Murdered, who always seems to come in. Uh, <laughs> yeah, no, no, not safe for work backgrounds here. My background is simply the logo to the podcast. So. Um, but uh, shout out to You Got Murdered 33 for always coming and hanging out as well. I appreciate you. Uh, you better be ready for Sunday because I'm about to whoop on you uh, and, and the rest of the team. So, um, But thank you guys again. You can find me here at twitch.tv slash Cage. You can also find this video up apparently in 24 hours because I need to get used to that uh, at youtube.com slash user slash Hunter Mega. Uh, because it didn't change my URL when I changed the name. Or you can just search Legion Cage. You can also find me on Instagram, reality underscore check underscore wrestling podcast, on Twitter at Legion Cage, or you can find the Facebook group for my podcast at facebook.com slash reality check 16. Greatly, greatly appreciate everyone who comes and hangs out with me um, making that drive to 50 uh, for uh, affiliate status and. Uh, even though I am not at 50 followers just yet, uh, my stats as far as average viewership continue to look good because you guys are coming and constantly hanging out with me. So, again, thank you all. Much appreciated. Talk to you later.